Hello everyone! Today I wanted to talk real quick about a new camera that works with the DJI FPV system called the Cadex Nebula. So this video is for those of you who subscribe to this channel to be kept up to date with the DJI FPV system. And as you know, in the last firmware update uh, back in April, DJI let us all know that a uh, new camera called the Cadex Nebula was now supported. So that got everyone excited and speculating about what this new camera might be. And some people thought it might be a camera for flying in the dark. Some people thought it might be you know, a higher resolution camera or perhaps one that does 16 by 9 natively because the current camera does a 4 by 3 native aspect ratio. Or maybe uh, perhaps a nano size camera. Well, Cadex has now released some information about what this camera is. And as you can see here on their website, the predictions about it being a smaller nano-sized camera were right. It is a 3.9 gram, or if you wanted to compare it to the original camera, uh, the original was an 8.2 gram camera, or you could say it's 4.3 grams lighter, or about half the weight of the original camera. And they state it is a 14 millimeter by 14 millimeter size, where the original camera is roughly 21 millimeters instead. The Cadex website states that this camera is a 720p 60 frames per second camera, which I'm a little bit confused about if they just didn't list all the specs or what that means because the original Air unit, I believe, does both 720p 60 frames per second and 720p 120 frames per second. Or at least that's what you can set in the goggles when you've got the low latency mode, you get the 120 frames per second. So I don't know if that means that this camera can't do the 120 frames per second, or if they just didn't list that, or exactly what that means. I guess we'll have to wait for some reviews to find out. And really, like, that's it. That's all the information we have about this camera right now. The Cadex website mentions that it's coming soon. It doesn't give any details about when. I'm not sure what the price is going to be. Uh, the original camera, you can buy a new one for about $60. Hopefully, since this is a Cadex product, the camera will be less than that. But sometimes you pay more because they it costs more to miniaturize something. And since this is a lot smaller than the original camera, uh, who knows? It could go either way. But uh, if any of you out there have any more information on this camera, please leave a comment. I'll be curious to see some footage once the review units get out in the wild and Cadex ready to, to release them. So if this interests you, be on the lookout for these to be available sometime soon.